Hello guys, today is a drink with me, not eat with me while my kids are in Kumon. And let me tell you what just happened to me, okay? Don't mind the dandruff, okay? It's hot up in here. Anyway, so I was in Ross, minding my business, finding some cute stuff for our trip, like more slippers or like, I actually found these really cute welcome slippers for me and Ari, so I had that in my shopping cart. And then I'm going to look for sizes for like Lily and Leia. Oh my God. Oh my God, what is that rat's nest? whatever and tell me why i start choking out in ross in the middle of nowhere like i can't breathe my throat is like on fire i'm like non-stop coughing i'm trying my hardest to hold it in but then i feel like i'm suffocating myself so i'm like oh god and then like my eyes is all teary i don't know if anybody's seeing me choke choke in there so i'm like you know what it's either i leave right now don't buy anything or I go into the checkout line. You know how they always have like those water bottles for sale. Which I don't know if we should trust those. But like I was like okay you know what. I'm just going to go across the street go to McDonald's. I didn't even take a sip yet because I feel fine now. So I go into the McDonald's line. There's a line with like four cars. And then there's a line with only the car ordering. So of course I go behind the lady that's ordering. Bro all the cars that was in the other line is all in the front now. And then I'm waiting. Because this lady is like ordering the whole menu. So I'm like, God damn, like I'm choking in my car right now. I'm still coughing and choking. Finally, my turn to order, I order. And then I'm already pulled forward and the other car is like still ordering. What does this lady do in her Mustang? She cuts me off like almost trying to bang the front of my bumper because I guess she thought it was her right to go. Like lady, I was already here. I was done ordering. You were still ordering. Now you want to cut me off? So I'm like, okay, whatever. Like I'm fucking choking in my car, people. I just need my frappe. Because it was free, I used my my point. But now I'm better. And um, you know the parking chronicles over here, where there's just no parking where I need parking, so I'm just parked randomly. And then I park, and then the guy parks in front of me, so now we're just facing each other. Eye contact. It's like an older guy, and he's just sitting there eating something. So now I'm like, great, just great. We're just gonna face each other. So I was contemplating moving my car, but then he got out of his car. So now I'm talking to you guys. God. Oh my God! Look, a cyber truck. I've never seen one in Ever Beach. Very ugly. Very, very ugly. Can I see it? Did you guys see the cyber truck? I mean, it looks like they will survive the apocalypse if we ever had one. Maybe black the tent out though. Unless he wants to be seen. It's just clear. Fishbowl. I want to go and like knock on it. Like, I want to knock on the car. He got out of his car. I want to so badly go knock on it. It's like a tin. Like, it makes me want to knock on the car. Anyway, so now I'm just going to sit in the car. I contemplated going to Safeway now to go get something for dinner. But I don't want to. I don't want to know. Now I'm just going to sit in my car, waste my AC, you know, put, what is it, chemicals into the air because my my car is running. Carbon monoxide? I don't know. Is that what it's called? Oh, great. The guy's back. The guy's back in his car. He doesn't even have anything. Where'd you go? Where you went that you know we're not in? I also the USP, USP, UPS store. Oh, I bought this for Aries fish tank. I used it. It's so fucking big. I don't know what I was thinking. Her fish tank is not that big, but I still tried to use it. And it basically sucked up her fish into the air filter. This part is like the suctioning thing to filter out the water. And tell me why four of her fish died because they got stuck in the air filter this suction part so i told her you know what i will buy you new fish when we come back from our trip because oh, another thing happened her fish did i guess tell you this already how um a child that i was watching my my fault he was playing in aries room playing with poppets and then there's bath bombs in aries room and usually he's fine he grabs the poppets and he comes out because he knows where the poppets are he threw bath bombs in Ari's fish tank and we didn't know until like hours later because we ended up leaving for her practice so when we got home her whole fish tank was green all bubbly foaming over and she was crying because it took us forever to find fish that were that would survive in her fish tank so i spent a lot of money on fish but those seven fish were going so strong and they grew like when we got them they're itty bitty and now they were like like they were like that big like they were big so she was crying I also wanted to cry because I knew that she was just so hurt. So then I bought her new fish, bought her a filter to make sure that every single soap bubble was out of her fish tank. And then that thing sucks up her fish and her fish die. So she has one fish that is 
just floating around still surviving everything else died and then after that incident i bought her more fish dead again dead so now she just has one fish that's just surviving but i promised her that i'll just buy her new fish when we come back from our trip because we leave on the 28th um yeah like who's even gonna wash her fish at this point so yeah that's my story for five minutes and 21 seconds and i'm just gonna sit here and be on my phone happy july guys <laughs>